Gray things don't normally engender excitement. Gray is the color of school socks, toilet roll tubes and accountant's worsted suits. But here gray is also the color of one of the most eagerly awaited bikes of 2014. Honda's all-new, completely revitalized and reinvented CBR. But if the color of this world first test bike, the machine we'd prized out of Honda's grasp just the day before, left us a little underwhelmed. Within moments of my first ride, it was clear little else would. The plan was to take this new machine on a big trip down memory lane. The CBR after all, in all of its four previous 600 guises, is a landmark machine. A bike that was not only hugely popular and significant throughout the 90s and noughties, but one that pretty much defined a generation. So we decided to head to Silverstone, where a reunion of all five models had been arranged. This world first ride tells the tale of that ride over. The reunion and the return. The return of the CBR. I guess I'd known for months it'd be good. Being the fared brother of the already launched CB650F. Which I'd tested extensively in Spain in March and predicted as one of my bikes of the year. Suggested the CBR version could hardly fail. What I'd forgotten was how refined and ridiculously easy to ride Honda's all-new 650s are as well. It shouldn't have been a surprise. Though an all-new bike, the newcomer does have over 20 years of development under its belt. What that means for the CBR is a machine that's comfortably proportioned and easy-peasy to feel. Instantly at home on. One that has a completely natural and CBR familiar sports touring riding position. And one that, if anything, is lighter than you expect so is an absolute dawdle to maneuver. On the move it gets better still. The gearbox and clutch are both snickety light. The throttle response immediate and, though no Gruntmeister, however, U2018 Meteor, it may be than old. The new CBR is still, ultimately, a middleweight 4 characterized by a free revving, uber smooth delivery. It pulls away easily from minimal revs. 3000 revolutions per minute does the job and from there on the new CBR builds utterly predictably. If you want to potter and travel, 3 to 6000 revolutions per minute is ample. A bit bolder and brisker will have you opening its lungs more crisply to 8. And if you want to.